Tell me, how can he be broke? How can they attack him without the way open for escape? No, stop. 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 Welcome you back to Lajumon Wash TV. I don't have violence for you today. The home of religious gossip. And the boys will leave your mind for Mohammed. What is happening in the Christian door? Turn down. Hello my great and wonderful viewers, welcome back to Life on Watch TV, coming across this channel for the very first time, ensure you click the red subscription button on your video screen and do want to click the notification bell icon, so that whenever we drop a new video in first time, YouTube will easily notify you about what is happening in the Christian world. Now I would like you to stay connected to this video because um, the man of God is going to be sharing the experience on video format on how Pastor Chris or Yakilomen called him at a certain time and were discussing with him and shouted at him. So um, I know it's going to be like a surprise to you but I would like you to stay connected to the end of the video. Don't forget to hear from him yourself. Stay connected and come back again. I want to show you the spirit of a king. It, see, it doesn't matter where you're working, it doesn't matter who you are. And these two guys were working there. When I passed by, I had already crossed the immigration, immigration area and got in. And they saw me and hurried and cursed the immigration officers to call me back. They didn't mind that there were people there. They suddenly forgot that they were cleaners. Pastor Chris, Pastor Chris, two of them, the, you know, and, 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 and this man called me back and look at these guys. They said, they, just, just, just touch us, just touch us. So I came in and prayed for both of them. Why were they so bold? They were not afraid of the officials. They were not afraid of the officials. I said they forgot that they were cleaners. Who could have been hushed? And then those men were now surprised. And they were wondering who I was. Why were these men suddenly go on their knees like this and they forgot about everything else and insisted that they called me because inside them is the shout of the king hallelujah are you hearing what i'm telling you it doesn't matter where you are right now. What is important is for you to know who you are. I'll tell you something, no matter where you, you find yourself right now, when you start talking, there are those who are going to say, who is this guy? Who is he? Because you don't sound like ordinary people. So who is he? They say, well, uh, he is the cleaner. He doesn't sound like the cleaner. Why? Because your spirit is not the spirit of a cleaner. Yeah. Who is this guy? Something happened. I don't know what really took place. And I think, uh, I don't know, prophetess would know better spoke to uh pastor pastor spoke to her and something happened there that pastor wanted to understand something he called me and i was sitting there and um pastor knew the whole thing i was waiting to be put as to be to be sworn in as the ambassador do you understand this you know this is the time i'm waiting to be sworn in as an ambassador i mean zimbabwe sitting like that and waiting for the following day to arrive and pastor has already approved it that yeah that is a good thing carry on he said i had to ask my own father he said okay there was another position i was supposed to be given pastor said nah, not that one 
and then I was given two you can be this or can be that and pastor said not this one so I'm waiting for that to happen and I get a call from pastor Chris and hello dad hello how are you I'm calling you in a few minutes in a few hours I said a few hours I'm doing something I said okay thank you thank you then I'm like what happened here this call gonna call me there was no conversation there just I'm calling you in a few and then around 11 12 midnight I get a call I'm sitting with my team there because you see it was so much it was so tense because we were politically for the first time we're in the political pool and people are fighting us mm -hmm. that's right that's true sir. and I'm sitting there pastor calls he's not talking about that thing about being an ambassador or anything he started shouting at me I'm like what what just happened here <laughs> <laughs> all the time he's like why why would you do this why would you do this I'm laughing but he's not hearing I'm laughing I'm really excited and I was with Pastor Blessing there it's like he speaks in Shona and he's telling me I'm hearing he's shouting there and you are you are you are excited I'm like ah. I put on mute Pastor is talking on the mid this side is reprimanding me and correcting me and I know it was a very very tight uh... <laughs> so Blessing is like why why are you, are you laughing? Mm. So when Pastor finished, um, I answered one thing. He said, oh, put the phone down. I'm going to call someone and I'll call you. You know, I think it was a miscommunication somewhere. And Pastor Blessing, and I'm not shouting the way you would think, like someone who has lost it, but correcting me in a very, very stern way. Yes, sir. And Pastor Blessing is like, that was your father reprimanding you and correcting you like standing like that why are you even smiling and not i said do you know who, who was shouting at me he said yeah i only know you you are major i said yeah but listen this many is chris oyakilome the chris oyakilome thinks he has authority to shout at me that tells me he has now fully accepted me as a son Whatever happens, the cause on any family, in the name of the Lord Jesus, whose I am and whom I serve, I command those causes averted today. The cause of struggling for survival, the cause of mediocrity as the experience of a lineage. These causes are declared averted today. The cause of career frustration. You are out of school with very good degrees, but you can't get a job. You walk and walk, walk around all that. No more shoes to wear. To attend an interview, you don't even know how to go there. In the precious name of Jesus, every cause of career frustration ravaging any family is declared averted today. This new week. Thank you for staying connected to the very end of this video. As you know, don't like or watch TV. Ensure you stay connected on this channel and check out all the videos about what is happening in the Christian. You should not look at the video very well. And I know this video really blesses you. It really blesses you. If you look at the video very well, you notice that the prophet Ibat Angel shared an experience where Pastor Chris Ayakulame called him. You know, Pastor Chris Ayakulame is the spiritual father of Ibat Angel. So, um, Pastor Chris Ayakulame called him one certain time and because of the discussion he wasn't expecting it when pastor chris shouted at him so this video is not meant to put on anyone or it's not meant to uh you know to speak against anyone just for you to hear the message and the message that is attached and i know that the message that is attached really blesses you it really helps you so if you have not subscribed to this channel before this like or watch tv ensure you click the resolution button on your video screen and do it with the bell icon so that whenever we drop a new video in your time youtube is in that fire you are going to get on that channel this for you join me on my social media handles on facebook at like or watch tv and like or entertainment on instagram at like Pong, and on twitter at like Pong. Guess what? See my next video.